What's up, cool cats and kittens? It is Uncle Mad back for phase two of Project Gemini. If you'll remember, I'll link it somewhere below. Phase one was basically we just built a shelf and put some Titans bobbleheads on it. It was fun, but now Christmas has passed. I have received all the additional pieces of furniture and equipment that I was planning to put into my room to kind of make it over and redo it. So got to get the old out, put the new in, revamp everything. And that's what we're going to do today. So thank you for joining us. Okay. So I went ahead and I built the desk and the computer chair. It's going to go in my room because I didn't think anybody would much care to watch me building furniture for the video, but we got to get the old furniture out before that can go into there. So for the time being, I'm making my home office here in the living room. I might keep it here permanently. This is actually the recliner that's going to go in my room too. I'm waiting to build that because I feel like I'll build that in the room where it'll fit better than build it out here and move it into there. But we've got the full office set up here. You can see Parker with the camera stand. We've already recorded some fabulous content for the vlog today at the new desk, the temporary location. More to come. Okay, so before we can move the new stuff in, brought in Kyle, everybody's favorite uh, curmudgeon, to help uh, move it. Oh, Jess said this she didn't think she was capable of it. <laughs> okay, so before Kyle forces me to use any more bleeps and bloops in the content, I'm gonna... Yeah. The old girl is a officially retired. Couch has been in the family, if you will, for quite a while. But if you're in the uh, market for a good quality, real leather couch, hit me up. All right, so the desk has arrived. This may not be its final home. I'm gonna get everything in here. Obviously, you can see there's a huge mess on the opposite side of the room while we're trying to organize and figure out what to do. But I want to get everything in here see what looks good where, and then kind of reorganize from there. So desk is in. Now I'm gonna build the new recliner I got. All right, so bless her heart, my wife purchased me a floor mat for the desk chair, but it is basically a hard piece of plastic that will not unroll from its rolled up state. But I could not help but not share this brochure that came with it with all its funny content, such as active your warranty. Just absolutely hilarious. See some of the instructions. You've got Cherry Master is use friction or low pile carpet. What is low pile carpet? Is that a thing or am I making that up? No, that's a thing. We have high pile carpet because we have plush carpet. Chair mat is easy to clean. Easy to is one word. Office chair mat only clean with chemical free water. Chemicals can cause chair to mat to weaken and crack. Eco friendly material. No lead, safe, no smell. Desk chair can be cut. Be cut is one word. According to your use scene. I haven't figured out what my use scene is yet. Gotta work on that. One more, there's another one on here somewhere. Uh, surprise for you. Very nice. They won't offer you free gifts and stuff, but the product they sent is kind of crap, so. Nice little conversation here going over the uh, FAQs. Yep. No slip at all. Strong and very good quality. It can used at desk. Study. Family. Pet mats. Multifunctional for you. A new one has been ordered. Alright, here's where we're at. The recliner is installed. Desk is over there. Still a mess. Still quite a bit of work to be done to finish off Project Gemini. Okay, so it's actually been a couple months since the first part of this vlog got filmed. I had planned on kind of eventually doing more rearranging with everything in the room, but just never quite got around to it, so I kind of let, left it in the temporary state that it was when we first put everything together post-Christmas, so... I think I've got an idea now for what I want to do with the room, but it's kind of just a test. So I'll show you where we're at now, and then we'll kind of do a after 
if what I have planned works out, which I don't know if what I have planned is going to work out. But that's the fun of vlogging it is it might be a disaster, but it's all going to be documented and on YouTube because once I've filmed it, I have to post it. Those are the laws. YouTube makes me. Okay, so messy junk this aside, this is the temporary setup that ended up lasting for a few months. Desk in the corner over there. Recliner just kind of plopped in the middle of the room here. This is actually the main problem that needs to be adjusted because just having a recliner just kind of sitting in the middle of the room is just not ideal. So getting this into a corner or into a less obtrusive space is the main goal of this kind of rearranging here. And figuring out a way to make sure I keep two TVs, because obviously I need two TVs. So we have finished things off for the most part, so here is a kind of final look. Mostly got things straightened up the way I want them. Do have a couple items down there that still need to find a home spot on the wall or something. I'll have Sissy do that. She's always very good at hanging stuff. She actually hung all of my previous posters and items, so when she has some free time I'll get her up here to do just that. Okay. So, I believe that completes phase two, kind of phase three. We kind of had two phases in one in this vlog of Project Gemini, and for the time being, that concludes Project Gemini, the great Uncle Mad's room overhaul project. But, you know, I'd like to think that my room will always be in a state of becoming I won't, it'll never cease to be a blueprint of the future where I can live a life I can't find anywhere else in the world. I may have just read that off of my phone. <sighs> Somebody wanted to be on the vlog. Okay, you can be in it. Sweating because I moved a lot of stuff, carried a lot of stuff downstairs, carried a lot of stuff out. But very happy with the status of everything, the way the room turned out. So there may be one more somewhat major update to come. I left a nice little space here for activities, potentially fitness activities. Potentially a expensive exercise bike activity. Who's to say though? That just might be my spot where I lay down and think my thoughts and look over at fake Matt and wonder what he's thinking. Either way, as always, if there's any future updates, if there's a new phase of Project Gemini or an entirely new project in and of itself, first place you'll hear about it is right here on the channel. So make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you've got the bell turned on for notifications so that you get alerted when we go back and do new things and different things, not only in my room, but across the entire world. But mostly just here in my room. Give this video a thumbs up, not a thumbs down. Let me know in the comments down below, do you see anything I could do differently? Or how I could utilize the space more? Should I get a Peloton bike? Wink. But that's all. I've got this extra space now in my room, now that the couch is gone, now that I've rearranged where the recliner and the desk are, so it's more easy than ever for me to say this to you and you to be able to follow through with it. Don't stand so close to me. 
Oli does not listen to that instruction. He's always about two feet behind me, and sometimes I step on him because he stands too close to me. So don't be like Oli. Don't get stepped on. Don't stand so close to me. And to all who come to my room, welcome.